We are at the Walmart. We're about to go in. Um, I wanted to just show you all the Walmart candles individually. That way you can see the Walmart candles individually. We can talk about them. I'll include one of my reviews um, at the end of this video. That way you can know more about the Walmart candles and my thoughts on the Walmart candles and how they're performing so far. Um, but if you guys are not subscribed to the channel right now, right now is the time to subscribe to the channel. Make sure your notification bell is on so anytime I upload in this thing, you are alerted. I do Candle News Network. It's a morning like uh, newscast in the morning just to get your days going to let you know about Bath and Body Works and different deals and stuff like that. I also do on my channel a lot of videos on, of course, body care. We do hauls, we do walkthroughs, uh, we do reviews. That's what we do on this channel. So if you like those type of videos, definitely make sure your notification bell is on and you're subscribed. But um, today's video is all about the Walmart candles and that's what we're going to be reviewing and talking about and going through. I like the Walmart that I'm at um, in Round Rock because this one doesn't play music. Well, they normally don't play music hopefully they don't have music on today because i like to be able to talk in the video and some of the locations have this music going and you can't talk so enough of me talking let's go ahead and get into the store so these are the ones i was talking about so they have warm apple pie it's baked apple cinnamon and spice on the bottom it really doesn't give any like descriptions of the company it came from though so it just says distributed by Walmart Inc. So that's what it says. And they're 14 ounces with the candle as well. So yeah, they have that one. They have Fall Farmhouse is Spice, Cypress, and Amber. That one looks pretty cool. This is the one I keep being on the fence about. It's Country Holiday. It's Winterberry. It's what is that snowdrop petals cypress started on with the dang on music y'all so i had to go ahead and uh do a voiceover but this is mystic fog um blood orange pumpkin that thing is so good like it slaps i did not pick it up because i feel i have something from bath and body works just like it um and then i always say ghoulish screams this is the generic version of the haunted house or haunted whatever um from bath and body works that just came out like it is like the soul generic fifth grade design version of it <laughs> and i thought that was pretty funny um but i mean these aren't bad candles for the price point because they're only five dollars and some change so they're not very expensive and they all smell great i mean i can never really say that about like a line of candles that came out from bath and body works i love the smell of every single one in the line that's very rare for me but in this little collection i loved every single one in the line and i wanted to ask y'all and i might get this to test it out if no one has tried this has anybody tried the better home and garden plugins um so they're supposed to be like the wallflower plugs from bath and body works but is the better home and gardens a version and they even have their own of course plugs like the refills and their refills are 293 yes bath and body works just had a sale and with the coupon took them down to two dollars and sixty cents which is great but when that sale is not happening like better homes and gardens had a nice little selection for um the two dollars and ninety three cents like like, I was really feeling it. And white peach and mango was one that was selling out pretty quickly. Um, you didn't see a lot of those sitting around. So have you tried these? Like now I'm intrigued and I really want to know what that do. And I think I might just bite the bullet if no one else has tried them. Like they had um, the oils and all that stuff. So I'm like, ooh, $5, that's not too bad. Room sprays going for $2.76 and $1.96. That again, that is not that bad for room sprays sprays in my opinion um they had other what is that like pure oils and stuff like that better homes and garden um they just had a lot of things that normally i'm like no bath and body works only i'm not going to touch this brand um they have mainstay um just so much to choose from and normally i don't give the time of day to the walmart with these items because i'm at bath and body works doing what it do there um but definitely let me know your thoughts on some of these items so i know if they're worth the buy or not um they had like the diffusers and all the oil warmers and stuff like that they even had the bigger candles with the more wicks going for like 13 dollars as you guys can see and i just flipped 
flip that over just to show you and they have three wigs on them and they're like really really big but for that price you could actually go to tj maxx or marshall's and you can get um one that has like eight wigs in it or something like that for that same price so for me that one wasn't that good but look at the packaging on a lot of these candles um they are really really pretty and come on carmel and kanye kanye oh my goodness cayenne <laughs> Kanye. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Anyway, um, don't pay me no attention. Okay. And then those are wood wick candles. So it's a wood wick uh, with those candles. I haven't tried those before, but, um, you know, it makes me want to try them. And these are uh, some of the other ones that they just came out with. Uh, these are three wicks as well. They seem pretty cool, especially that banana nut bread. I'm like, what that do? Banana nut bread. Y'all know I love the banana um, walnut muffin scent from bath and body works and i like the one that came from goose creek as well so oh i mean it's a, it's about that season to go ahead and pull it out we're at the end of september but i want to wait to october because it's still too hot like it's just it's too hot like texas need to chill like why is it 100 degrees outside it does not need to be 100 degrees right now it does not but it is so let's get on to the review of ghoulish screams i think that's what it's called um the packaging uh the packaging since i know it's kind of copying the bath and body works one uh, the packaging i gotta give it about a six and a half okay it's just not hitting like the bath and body works so from the notes i was like oh my goodness would this be close to bourbon maple from white barn and you know with bath and body works so i put the two next to each other and guys these two are not the same that one is not that strong the one from white barn like it ain't it ain't slapping like i needed it to slap in the open concept um living room it just wasn't doing it okay and that was kind of a disappointment you had to get close up on it for it to do what i needed it to do but this one right here this one right here from walmart five dollars and 96 cents it filled that whole open concept which was surprising to me um and look at the wicks the one from bath and body works the wicks are thicker and as you can see they're mushrooming so i have to before i burn it again trim my wicks um and the one from you know walmart the wicks are thinner but you can see that we already have sitting going on with the bath and body works is a clean burn with this one it's not as of clean burn but you know it is what it is it was five dollars and 96 cents what i care about is performance and i just feel that the one from walmart did outperform the one from bath and body works in this scent because when i came into the room all i got was maple and everything hitting me in my face and it was a 10 out of 10 with the smell on that one but with that bath and body works one i feel like it wasn't giving in the open concept room what i needed it to give so in that aspect the one from walmart wins like so i was very impressed with it normally i say the walmart candles are good for um a smaller room but because the smell was so strong out the gate i decided to just test it in a bigger room and i was not disappointed now i say give it some time to get the scent going at least about two hours i mean you could get it on cold right away and then when you light it you'll get the smell you'll get it but give it a little bit to ramp up amp up leave the room come back after about 10 minutes and you'll be like oh my god i smell it and i smell it and it's lit you know what i mean so definitely i think the candles are worth it in my opinion but the candle i'm really feeling above all right now are those new ones from huntington home from aldi like that even trumped this candle out big time like the one from huntington home y'all after about 30 minutes or so to an hour i had to like pull it out i was like uh it's too strong it's too strong now when a candle is too strong and is under five dollars now that one's live so um i definitely would say you know that is your best best way to go but um i'm enjoying the candle it's really nice would i repurchase another one yes i would and i would recommend it the one from bath and body works i'm not getting another one of the bourbon maples so i hope you guys enjoyed this video remember rate comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys